someone came to you and said, quit your job and do whatever you want to do, anything, follow your dream, follow your passion. Well, that happened to the man I'm with, Drew Rogers, with Drew's Pastry Shop. What an incredible gift. And this was actually something your wife came to you, what, when you turned 40? When I turned 40, she asked me if time and money was no object, what would I want to do? And this is it. And uh, it's been a dream come true for me. Well, and an incredibly successful one, too. You've been on TLC. Correct, the bakery boss. And it, ever since then, it's been more of a ride, which has been great. Fantastic. Well, and, and the pastries are incredible. I should say, Drew Thank is you. Italian. <laughs> and the first I fell in love with what you do was the cannoli. I took them on a TV segment and took a bite of one to taste it, and it blew me away. It was so authentic. Well, it's, you know, the, what we grew up with was a nice, um, creamy, filling not grainy not too sweet and just the right amount of you know little spices in there and over the years this is what we came up with and it's it's been a hit well and when you buy a cannoli here at drew's they fill it to order so you're not buying one that's been sitting there for an hour or two hours or whatever that's right they're fresh from the start now you took the passion for the cannoli one step further with the cannoli cupcake yes we we do a cannoli cupcake now and we fill it on the inside with simple syrup and then also with the cannoli filling and then on top we put the cannoli filling and chocolate chips and the shells of the cannolis. And so worth it. That's always my dessert bar barometer. Is it worth <laughs> it? Everything of yours I've tried is totally worth well, it. Well, thank you it's so wonderful. much. I appreciate and that. And you're thing. sharing your recipe for the tiramisu. Yes, we do an authentic tiramisu. Um, people all over have said our tiramisu is wonderful. Yeah. And so I decided to share it with it's you guys. It's the real deal. So, if, yeah. if you go in the kitchens in Italy, anywhere in Europe that do the real thing, this is what you're going to see. Okay. So this is a small batch that people can make at home. Right. And we have six egg yolks and then we have six ounces of sugar. So however many egg yolks you have, that's how many ounces of sugar you so put even, in. Okay? okay. And then a pound of mascarpone cheese. Right. And then I put in um, vanilla bean paste. You can use vanilla extract if, if you're home like that, but I like the vanilla bean paste because of the little pieces of vanilla that are in there. So once you get the tiramisu filling, for lack of a better word, the, the true tiramisu done. Okay, so we also make our own uh, lady fingers here also. And what we do is we put them in cups like this so people can take it to go. So we get our lady fingers, we cut out a piece of the lady finger, we put it in the bottom, mm -hmm. and then we take this is um, espresso and simple syrup, and we soak the bottom here, okay? So it's nice to get that flavor in there. And you take the, the tiramisu, uh -huh. and we just pipe it all the way in there, about halfway, because then we're gonna come back and put another layer of ladyfinger, and then we'll do the same thing here. Soak this nice so you get that coffee flavor. Put another layer up here. And the good stuff. The, yep, and then we will powder it with cocoa, cocoa powder, powder. And, 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 it's fabulous. and then you have it right there. It's, it's wonderful. wonderful. It, it, again, it is so worth your time to come here. You'll leave with boxes of goodies. It's 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 all worth it. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate Drew, it. Drew, thank uh, you.